Thank you all so much for again for joining me on my YouTube channel. As I mentioned before, I'm super excited to have you guys <clears throat> join the YouTube channel. Really, I want to focus this t this video on trying to help give advice. You know, if you're going through anything and how you should want to go through things when it comes to either changing your career, or going back to school, a lot of us think of how we can get that advice of where to start. So, you know, if you are at any age, at any point in time in your life right now, the most important thing you could do for yourself is think about what you want to do and why you want to do it. But also think about what makes you happy when you're doing it. And I say that to say, you know, one thing that's super important that we don't think about are ways to either leave a legacy for our children or leave a legacy for ourselves uh, to have something to hold on to, even if we do leave this earth. And the important part and how I want you to think about this opportunity is with preparation comes opportunity. So uh, when we think about preparation meets opportunity, I want you to think about, as I mentioned before, what's important to you. So when it comes to changing careers <clears throat> or going back to school, what I highly advise is starting an LLC. Name the LLC whatever you want. If you start an LLC, what this will do is open an opportunity for you to actually have a business. And with that business, you will now have a social security number, which is called an EIN that will be attached to that business that you will then be able to create net 30 accounts and build a business credit line under that business. Now, the reason I'm sharing this information is because once you have a certain amount of business credit, just like credit under your own name, you will now want to remove everything from your own name or any assets under your name and put them under your business. And the reason you would want to take out loans or put things under your business is, is that so it doesn't tie to your own credit score, but also your business can either leverage that as an asset to take out larger loans. And this is how people in business usually are able to scale their business or how the rich people can continue to take out larger loans to stay rich, to invest in more properties or invest in more things quicker. So for all of those of you who are like, you know, I got to have a business idea. I got to do something. You actually don't. You actually just need an LLC. Think about what you might want to sell. Like myself, I manufacture. Guess what? I can manufacture anything that I can, my little heart desires. With that being said, I actually do manufacture lip balm, coconut stick. Go check it out, coconutstick.org. But the important part is, is even though I manufacture, their LLC allows me to create a business line of credit to then purchase things like cars under that business ad, uh, under that business credit, purchase things like houses or purchase your brick and mortar for your business if you do get it to that point. So these are just things that we don't always think about. And the nice part about it is people think that and actually don't know if you take out a hundred thousand dollars against your business. Most people don't know the highest payment is $500 a month. So with that being said, in 12 months, when people are only paying $6,000 against that $100,000 and they go spend the other $94,000 on investments or investing into other things or whatever, that's how the rich people are getting rich. So I hope this video was helpful. As I mentioned before, follow, like, and subscribe. I'm just here to show, share helpful tips that I'm doing, not only with my small business, but within my career being a business development manager. Uh, as I mentioned, sales isn't for everybody, but if you're looking to change your career, I highly advise in getting into software as a service.